Today's lesson is Lesson 100, Simplifying Decimal Numbers. When we simplify, uh, or when we write a number, we usually write it in its simplest form. And to simplify a number, we change the form, but we don't change the value. For example, I can simplify fractions by reducing them. We can simplify decimal numbers by removing unnecessary zeros. And so to show you this, I'm going to give you the decimal number 0 0.20. The decimal number 0 0.20 has a 2 in the tenths place. The 0 in the hundredths place means that there are no hundredths. If I remove the 0 from the hundredths place, I still have the 2 in the tenths place. So I know that 0 0.2 is the simplified version of 0 0.20. I can get rid of extra zeros at the end of a decimal. You can also remove zeros from the front of whole numbers and the back of decimal numbers. For example, if I have the number 0 0.02, Point zero one zero zero. To simplify this, I can get rid of zeros before whole numbers and zeros after decimal places. So the simplified form would be 2.01. You cannot get rid of this zero because it has a number that comes after it. If I wanted to simplify the number 20.0, I can get rid of the zero after the decimal place. And since there are no other numbers, that means I can also get rid of the decimal. So the simplified version of this would be just be the number 20. This problem says Otis added 3.75 to 2.75 and found the sum was 6.50. Simplify this sum. I'm going to take the number 6.50 and I'm going to get rid of any extra zeros. The only extra zero we have is this one at the end. So the simplified version would be 6.5. This problem says attach a zero to the end of 5 without changing the value of the number. With this one, if I take the number 5 and if I just added a 0 to it, the number would be 50. And 50 is not the same thing as 5. So if I want to add a 0 to the end of a whole number without changing the value, I have to add a decimal place and then a 0. Because 5 is the same as 5.0. Because numbers with, after the decimal point with the 0 makes it so the number doesn't change. It still has the same value. And that's it for this lesson. Good luck.